are you doing out here? Um, dying of heat stroke. Thank you. Well, that makes sense. It's pretty hot out. But what time is it? Uh, let me check. Uh, uh, about 12.30, I would say. 12.30? Diego, what are you doing here? It's Sunday, my dude. No, no, I'm pretty sure it's Tuesday. Oh no! What's up, heart? Uh, where's Nico? No. Okay, okay. Everything's okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm not late. I'm Nico. <laughs> and I'm what's left of Jade? Today is Tuesday, September 6th. And today we are celebrating Murphy's Law Day. Nico, I don't think I need to wear this bandage anymore. Yeah, you're probably right. We don't want to get confused with our mummies. Really? I think we should have thought twice before we signed up for Murphy's Law Day. I totally agree. Doing some research beforehand would have been a smart idea. You think? For those of you who haven't guessed it, everything has already gone completely wrong. And we'll continue to do so until this show finally ends. Quick! Everyone stand for the pledge while we still can. Yeah, that's a good idea. Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Here's Mr. Dotremont with your Monday morning message. Uh, it's Tuesday, Nico? The Murphy's Law Strikes again. Here's your Tuesday morning message. Welcome back on a Tuesday, Hart. First quarter progress reports come out at the end of this week, so make sure you're keeping up in your classes. I hope that you all had an excellent three-day weekend and stayed cool out there. Remember, it will still be hot today and tomorrow, so please stay hydrated and in the shade when out on campus. It's homecoming week here at Hart, and a week where a lot of our attention will be directed towards our beloved Larry Fiscus. For those of you who didn't know Larry, I wish you could have. Friday will be dedicated as Fiscus Friday, which follows our homecoming rally and carnival on Thursday night here on campus. You don't want to miss it. Come back out to COC on Friday night and enjoy homecoming night, where we will have a special presentation before the game for the Fiscus family, and then homecoming activities at halftime. Saturday, we will hold a memorial service for Larry here on campus. All are welcome to join. Our first student of the week this year is Lillian Leclerc. Lillian does an excellent job communicating and being an involved student. A week ago, her teacher saw her observe a student who was in need of a little assistance. The student was on crutches and had missed a few days. Lillian asked if she could grab the missing hard copy paper assignments and help the student read and follow the Google Classroom calendar. Stepping up and caring about another student's success, as well as taking the time to help another student, are qualities that help make the Hart family a great one. Thanks for adding some kindness, Lily. Hart High is better off when we operate like you did in class that day. To end today, remember students, we have free breakfast and lunch from the cafeteria each day as long as you show your student ID. Have a great short week. For Larry, Dotremont. Thank you, Mr. Dotremont. Here's your weekly weather forecast. Good morning, all frat boys, frat women, and all types of frat people. This is your weekly weather report. Today, Tuesday, is a high of 106 and a low of 77. It will be very hot and very sunny. Tomorrow, Wednesday, it will be a high of 104 and a low of 77. Once again, it will be very hot and very sunny. 
The next day, Thursday, it'll be a high of 104 and a low of 75. Once again, very hot. Once again, very sunny. Oh, whoa. Hey, bro, bro, bro. Bro, are you, are you okay, bro? I'm okay, bro. That was Sophie Adelini reporting for RTV. Now back to you in the studio. Cut. Well, it's going to be another hot one. Uh, we'll be back right after this. Hello there. Do you like Star Wars? If you do, you should join Star Wars Club. Our first meeting is today in room F11 during lunch. Hope to see you there. And may the Force be with you. And now, the news. Girls golf compete in league number one. JV play at Chica at two o'clock and varsity play at Vista Golf Course at one o'clock. It's homecoming spirit week all this week. And today is frat day. Dress like a frat boy, button ups, backwards hats, and sunglasses. Tomorrow is who let the dogs out Wednesday. So wear your favorite open toed sandals. Thursday is Aloha Hawaiian day. Wear lays, Hawaiian shirts, sunglasses, khakis, and more. And Friday is Fiscus Friday Red Out. Wear your heart gear or red and we will be celebrating Larry the Legend, the namesake of our beloved Fiscus Field. Homecoming, King and Queen voting has begun. Check your school email to vote for your 2022 Homecoming King and Queen to be crowned at the football game on Friday night. Voting closes on Friday at lunch. Your homecoming nominees are Andrew Stoker, Colin Bailey, Mark Lopez, Max Garcia, Patrick Doan, and Sean L. And your homecoming queen nominees are, I'm sorry if I pronounce any of these names wrong, Angelina Saraswati, Charlotte Curtis, Haley Michelson, Holly Heyer, Natalie Spivy, and Zoe Abanez. Hart's annual homecoming carnival and rally is this Thursday in the Hart Quad from 5 to 8 p.m. Admission is free to enter the carnival, but bring money for raffle tickets and to purchase food, snacks, and play games. The rally will start at 6.30 p.m. See you there. Junior Chamber International Santa Clarita is hosting a teen financial workshop called Get Real, Adulting 101. This Saturday, September 10th, at the center in the SCV Sports Complex. This is an in-person game that will show whether you've got what it takes to have it all. Stop between 10 a.m. and 4 p.m. to play the game and to learn some valuable life skills. All participants will be eligible for raffle prizes. I love raffle prizes. Go to GetRealSCV.com for more information. A representative from UC San Diego will be visiting our campus on Tuesday, September 13th from 947 to 1047 in the library. If you are interested in attending this presentation, please stop by the counseling office to sign up and pick up a permission slip. Math and science tutoring will be available today at lunch in J1. All levels of math, all levels of science, come in and get the help you need. CSF applications are due no later than 8.30 a.m. this Wednesday, September 7th to Miss Hughes' room in C2 or placed in her mailbox. Application forms are available on the CSF Google Classroom code D2L4666 or on the Heart website. Please attach your spring 2022 report card and $2 for dues. Freshmen are not eligible at this time. You know what time it is? Clubs! Robotics Club meets today at lunch in room C2. All are welcome. Young Americans for Freedom will be hosting their annual 9-11 flag ceremony at 6 a.m. this Friday, September 9th. We will be planting a flag for each person who died on 9-11. Coffee and donuts will be provided. If you'd like to participate in this inspiring event, please sign up in Mrs. Cruzy's room, M5. If you want to stay up to date with the Red Cross Club, please join using the Google Classroom code AC. 462Z5. The next meeting will be held on Tuesday, September 13th in Mrs. Williams' room, S2. All existing and new members are welcome and encouraged to attend. We hope to see you there. Now it's time for today's... Quote of the Day! If anything can go wrong, it will go wrong at the worst possible moment. Murphy's Law. Well, that's it for our show. Everyone, please stay safe while enjoying Murphy's Law Day and the Frat Boy Spirit Day. And stay, stay classy, classy, heart. Oh, oh man. man.